Oh my god, we're melting everywhere. <laughs> oh god. That reminds me how one of our houses used to act where we were leaving. That was like a driveway and you had massive fields on this side. Mm hmm. On another, and that was uh -huh. lovely. Great. Great story. <laughs> ah! <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh well guess what I got on my ice cream or flavour. Can anyone guess what Sylvia's got on her ice cream? It's an old lady flavour. <laughs> it is. So what did you have on your ice cream? A rum and raisin. A rum and raisin. And pistachio. Pistachio. Mm -hmm. I came to the conclusion that why the hell is um, the ice cream buns is still called 99, they're called 99s, but they're not 99p anymore. Mm -hmm. Inflation. And they should change the name. Can I have a £1.23 please? <laughs> doesn't sound the same, does it? Oh no. Squeeze into the car park space. Never mind, there's a whole field empty. Mm -hmm. We gotta get close as we can. Don't forget lucky car. So I've been off work today and Sylvia's been to work. Finishes early on a Friday and she said, Shall we go get some ice cream? Just like that. We're on a text. So it was more like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We've come to Snug Breeze, but it's the one by our house. We've got weddings over there, so we were gonna go have a look, but the people are wearing suits and things so i think there's a wedding on or a wedding being prepared so yeah we've come to snug breeze congleton road sylvia had um rum and raisin and pistachio and she's really really enjoying that ice cream mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i don't work fridays and i don't work thursdays i get or sundays or sundays i get thursday friday off I only work saturday morning i don't mind it everywhere is so busy on a saturday i finish at 2 30. Oh. I was just gonna do that. <laughs> I was getting ready to go out my tooth. <laughs> Where will they squeeze? That Ooh. between the Volvo. Where are they gonna park? Where are they gonna park? Gotta be in there. I can't see any spaces. Oh, there's one here at the side of this van. Mm -hmm. Let's go park there. Oh gosh, look at the bench. Whee! <laughs> I think maybe it was standing up originally. There's this little fly. Little green fly. <laughs> oh, I forgot to introduce you as well. So, you know Sylvia, and you know me. I forgot to introduce you to this guy on the side of my head. God, Look at that. <laughs> Massive spot come from nowhere. I never get spots like this. I got one on my neck too. Look. You oh see? Gosh. Yeah. Where is it? On the finger. Yeah. Here. Oh, I can't feel it. I could feel it earlier. Maybe it's gone down. So yeah, this guy, it needs a name. Anybody can think of a name, a funny name, comical. Like Wayne the Wart, not a Warto, is it? Or Sam the Spot, or Adam the Acne, Barbara the Blemish. <laughs> it's like a little hot rod. Shame it's getting so rusty. Pretty cool though. Oh nice! Oh nice! Imagine driving cars like that these, these days. Is that an Austin badge? Anybody know? I think it's in Austin. Like Stone Cold Steve Austin! Yeah, imagine just walking up to your car, to put your key in, open the door. How many miles on the clock do you reckon, Sylvia? It's a bit rusty and dirty, but I think I can see four digits. It's done over a thousand. Oh, look at these little compartments here. I wonder what that's for. Maybe checking some levels or something, but I don't know what. And the bonnet, um, the bonnet folds there in the middle and goes upwards, sideways. Same both sides. 
I think they should have bonnets like that still. Imagine that on my Passat. <laughs> Little hinge in the middle. Mm. This car's filthy. Look at all that stuff in there. So my room's all back to how it should be. We've had Sylvia's dad staying with us for a week. We actually took him back a couple of days ago now, but I'm so grateful for what he's done while he's been here. Uh, I can't thank him enough. It's been absolutely fantastic having him here. Fortunately, because we don't have a spare room, we had a, this inflatable bed here and it's got a headboard and everything on it. And we had it on the floor here. So he had his own space and we just moved everything out. But we had some stuff lying around the house because we've, we've been decorating and things like that. So everything was just shoved under the table. It's all back away now, it's all in its place. How good does that light look, by the way? It looks fantastic. There's a little story behind this light, why it's here. Not something I'd usually have inside uh, my house, but it was brought for a studio that I was using. I did say in a, a live chat that I did, I announced that I was doing a podcast. Now, that was something that I planned since last August. I spent a lot of money so far setting up this podcast, whether it's just equipment like wiring and things like that. I mean, I brought a new computer so that my laptop could be used for the podcast. So I've got the uh, the Mac Mini over there now. I brought loads of lighting. That was one and some panel lights that are different colors. I brought a camera another camera because I wanted two or three angles specifically brought it for the podcast and I spent probably with paint and wiring and not even putting into consideration the hours and hours that I spent setting it up painting everything I mean cleaning for god's sake like cleaning the carpets out cleaning the place in general like because it needed it so badly I got the place ready for the podcast and then I was told I can't use the room anymore I was really gutted over it. It upset me because of the time. I was kind of worried because of the camera. I mean, lighting can be used anytime. And yeah, of course the camera will get used, but it's not money that I have right now. I so much wanted to get the podcast done and I practiced and practiced and got everything perfect. And it's something that I've literally planned now for 10 months. Bit of a slap in the face. Felt like a bit of a, a dickhead, I won't lie. And the reason I felt like a bit of a dickhead sorry for my language, was because I've just spent £700 on a camera, £900 on a computer, I spent about £300 on lighting. I've, I've, not, I've not really voiced my opinion on the whole thing and I've kind of just, I announced the podcast, but I've kind of just kept it on the down low, but it, it's been bothering me recently, it has been bothering me, because I've, I've learnt my lesson, I've learnt my lesson, I am never... Apart from like Sylvia, I am never going to rely on anybody ever again for anything. I'm not a bad person. Like I'm not a bad person and I've, I've never, I never expect nothing from anybody. I've never, never once been like that. I don't expect nothing for free. I will, I will do anything for somebody. If they needed me, I would always help people. I've never gone out of my way to hurt somebody. And yeah, I, I stupidly, stupidly got myself in this situation and now I feel like the idiot. Hi doggy. Dun 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 This is Yeah this floor looks amazing. Look at it. Wow. So shiny. It is so shiny. Hopefully it stays that way. With this guy little guy. Yeah he's just spitting food out all over the place. Mr. Tiki lad. What are you doing, Tiki boy? Give me a cuddle. Cuddles. Don't you want your father, bro? Back. Should we give it to Neptune? Mr. Neptune, let <laughs> me swing. Does that feel good? Are you okay, Mr. Neptune? You're, you're a good boy, aren't you? you eh? You're a good boy, you wouldn't bite me. Like some people. We've had this flooring done, but Sylvia's dad, he came for the entire week. He wasn't working for a full week. We did take him to, where did we take him to, Sylvia? 
Oh, we took him to Cosford. Cosford, yeah, we did a video. I don't know if I pronounced it correctly. Yeah, you did it right. Cosford. So we went oh. to Cosford. I've made a video there and <laughs> we decided to take him there again. I didn't film that, I didn't film that day, did I? No, no I didn't film that day. I didn't film that day, but I filmed previously to going there. Better turn this music down because I'm going to get this video demonetized. He's like, take that big green look on his face. Is that that <laughs> okay, so I'll show you the other thing that we've had. I just beeped. Hey. I'll show you the other thing that we had done. Put on my put on my crocs. crocs. Okay, so I'm going outside and I'll just show you. <gasps> wow, look at the lean too. Let me show you from over here. Happy? Very happy. Look at it. Oh, so amazing. See this fence here? The little fence? You made that. No, we made it, not me. We did it together. Whoa, 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 whoa. That looks like a doodle. That is big, Julia. What are you doing? <laughs> Filming the doodle. -doo. Say thank you, Father. Thank you, Father. Say it in Polish. Dziękuję, Tato. Dziękuję, Tato. Look at this thing, guys. Sylvia said it's a bush cutter. I really, really want to go. Wow, look at that. DX61 HNC. That's cool. Oscillating as well. We're in the carvery. Just nipped into B and M. We're after a small pot. Earlier on, we sat downstairs and we heard this loud crashing sound. And then when I ran upstairs, basically the, the curtain had blown because the window was open, knocked a plant onto the floor, cracked the pot, soil everywhere. We've got to clean that up still. I've come to look for a little pot and some potting soil. I think this is the potting soil. It's indoor stuff I need though. This isn't it. House plants, there we go. It's open. Oh, we haven't got a basket there, so we're going to have to carry this now. It's a bit of a shame. Just cleaned uh, Sylvia's car off, so that's uh, absolutely spotless now. We also need some stuff for like cleaning all the chrome as in the car, like the, the roof bars and things like that. If anybody knows any like hacks, how to get them like the chrome, metally chrome parts of a car looking like new again, then let me know, because I've tried a few things and I can't seem to get them to come up. Oh, he's like a square. He's a candle. Oh, candle. A pole. Quite he's nice a pots, actually. How much is it? Six. Yeah, this one is 350. What would you prefer? I like them, but I don't know if that's going to be too small for that our plant. Ooh. Squirt, squirt. Hello. Hello. Happy with your car? Very. Looks really good now. Oh my, oh my days. god. Hey. First time lucky. I think I was pressing lock, not unlock. <laughs> so yeah, look guys, we've polished and everything. It's not perfect, never is, but you know, it looks good. It's never perfect though, is it? Oh, I've done the black as well. I've used uh, like a back to black stuff on here to get that nice and same on here actually. I need to paint this in. That's just chipped away. Luckily it's not rusted. I can just paint over that. It's not a problem. Wheels. I've tried a few different things on these lights, but they aren't coming up very clean. They're a bit uh, cloudy. It's an old car though, 61. It's a 2012 model. So it's 11 years old now. It's an old car. Lots of stone chips on it. Mine's only six years old and you know it's the same. It's got a lot of little like big chip there, a rusty chip there. Happens. But it is filthy. Oh my god, dead flies. There's loads of them. Is that 
Yeah. I'll try to do it. There's another one. Okay guys, there's the way in. Okay, so it is the next day now and we've come to do some exploring, which we haven't done for a while. I think I said in a previous video, it might be this one earlier, I can't remember, it was yesterday. But I was saying that we're gonna have to get some exploring done soon. We haven't been out for a while and done anything video related, paranormal or exploring. This is somewhere that's recently become a little bit more well known. I've seen uh, Adam Mark explores come here. It wasn't too hard to find. I literally found it within five minutes. It's got a bit of a story. I'm not entirely sure on the history, but it's been nicknamed Sally's slash Susie's house. There's already a Sally's house. I've already been to that and done videos there. This one may or may not have a story, maybe a sad story. I don't exactly know. I'm going to make a complete separate video here, guys. I will include a little bit at the inside or, or maybe mainly just the outside. If you want to watch that, then maybe keep your eyes open for it or check out my channel, subscribe it's explore beyond Sylvia's found something I think it's real bio it's like spongy there's a little gargoyle in the tree it's a really pretty little house to be honest I bet it's a bit bigger inside than what it feels nice bit of land around it although there's a main road there which is pretty loud to be fair it's surrounded by trees and bushes yeah, it's good i like it it's a nice little nice little bit of shade under this tree as well so uh, yeah as you look around guys there's just teddy bears everywhere there's a little pathway just here so you've got to be mindful of that really teddy bears everywhere anything in that garage um this wall champion 1990s magazine yeah you okay it's like our new roof on the pergola we've had of course over. It's Sylvia's phone. A cool little strap. Sylvia's phone's got a strap on. Strap on. Oh my god, there's a rat! Oh Jesus. Oh, oh gosh, it's so cold. Jam. Yeah, black corner. Can do a quick intro, okay? Yeah. Oh my god. Yes. There's a doll in here as well. It's like a Victorian doll. No, that looks like one of them that we got a farm. Yeah, it does a bit. With a smaller version. A little bit does, yeah. Very tight. Hi guys, so we just pulled up um that way. So from the previous location we decided we're already out. Let's have a look if there's anything in the area we can find. So I had a location with a house uh, so we decided to come have a look at it unfortunately but with me there's a car coming unfortunately there's no house left like there's a barn here and there used to was a house what it looks like let's just go over quickly have a look it looks like it's been demolished quite a while ago because already growing through Yeah. There's a fire going. This is definitely someone using the land. Oh look at these! These little guys! Hi there! Hello! You're so cute! Hi there! Come on the Oh, don't run away! 
so yeah as you can as you can see over there there's a there's a fire going so you best not to even go there because I don't want an angry farm man having a go at me for not doing anything wrong because it's just open land. So we've been just driving and Sylvia managed to spot something with her little eye, something in colour of blue, too actually. So let's have a look. Oh, these are cool. Lots more astros. Yeah. These are cool. And I'm going to leave because I think we're on someone's property here. Be quick. Look like an abandoned farm, but it's uh, obviously not. So we're going to just leave it. But see, it looks very um, abandoned. Especially with them two cars there. There's a white one there. Oh yeah, the Astra. <laughs> Same car, but white. I feel like someone using this side. Well, there's a that house there is connected to it. Yeah. Coffee. Coffee time. What one? The wig. I think this guy is going all the way to Newcastle because we've been behind him now for about 10-15 minutes I was thinking that he'd be turning off at some point Oh sound! Oh my god! Oh will it ever end? I don't know Jeff! It's raining guys but it is so so refreshing Oh honestly yesterday all this rain started but the day has been so hot like today it's been 25 degrees there's doggy come on doggy i'm kind of i'm kind of happy though for this this rain in the skies it's only too bad on the camera actually it's it's quite dark and gray it is probably about 10 o'clock at night now so it's still still light i've kind of got a lot of editing to do i'm just starting a, a new video as we speak um it's actually at a really old hall probably a couple of hours away from where I live. Me and Sylvia went a few weeks back and it's quite an interesting place. I believe it's quite haunted too. I know, uh, I know Moxley went there and he said that it was like a really intense night that they had there. So I wouldn't mind maybe going there and doing some like proper, proper investigating at night. But either way, for now guys, I'm gonna end this video. So thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to check out my main channel, Explore Beyond. Drop a like on this video, subscribe if you are new and hopefully I will see you in the next video.